Yo, what's going on guys? Your boy X here and today we're doing that Dragon Ball Fighter Z discussion video. Now, if you was like me yesterday of the <laughs> of the making of this video, then you woke up to two new scans. You know, we found out that we got Android 18, Android 16, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Also, we found out that they have like a, a six player mode where, you know, one person picks a character and y'all can tag out. So it's like 3v3, but you know, three people versus is three people uh now that's all fine and dandy i'm still surprised we haven't gotten a trailer for krillin and piccolo yet <laughs> but we're not here to discuss all that we are here to discuss just the story mode today now i'm surprised um i haven't seen anybody so far now i might be wrong it might be people that made a video about it but i haven't seen anybody make a video about the story mode because i know when i read them scans that was both shocking to me <laughs> like first of all let me just say i am so happy that they're going with a what if story because i'm so tired and i said it before in another one of my videos but i'm so tired of that same cookie cutter story <laughs> cookie cutter story where you know if i wanted to if i wanted to just relive the uh the story of dragon ball z and beyond i just watched the anime to be honest with you guys so i'm happy that they're going with a what if story now what shocked me is the fact that they're making this what a story uh, based around Android 16 I was like I mean of all the characters you know throughout the whole Dragon Ball Z series they chose to do with you know with Android 16 and I'm like what like you mean tell me you couldn't pick somebody popular like bringing cell back or something but it was it was interesting you know I, it wasn't like I was mad or anything it, it was just intriguing I'm like how can they do this how can they make you know mr. snow white you know I call him mr. snow white cuz you know he's over here holding birds and stuff 24 7 how can you make mr. snow white into a cold-blooded killer like how can you do that like <laughs> like if y'all looked at the picture you know, look at the picture. This man got these boys looking like they just lost the tournament of power. Like they getting ready to get erased or something. Like, what's happening here? Like, and what's interesting is I'm trying to figure out when this story is going to take place. Like, at what time period. Because obviously this is going to have to take, a, you know, take apart. <laughs> that doesn't take apart. This is going to have to take place most likely after, like in super if anything because if we look at this picture right here one we have goku you know goku's here so obviously this and then you know also in the scan uh from what they say it says that um you know they somebody revived or, or like uh recreated android 16 so obviously this takes place after the cell saga and in the boost saga you know i don't i don't think this is gonna be happening during the boost saga. so i'm feeling like this is gonna be taking place during super so many reasons why i speculate that um more so of the roster but i'm gonna get into that later um so yeah, we have this picture right here, and then I'm like, well, if this takes place during the Super, uh, Android 16 should be no problem. He should, he should be defeated like in a matter of seconds. And I'm trying to figure out, is Android 16 gonna be the villain throughout the whole story? Like, is, just, is it just gonna be Android 16, or is it gonna be uh, some more villains? Is it gonna be a different villain? Because you gotta wonder who brought this man back to life, who created this man. And I had some speculations with that I want to discuss real quick. You know, it's, it's really between three, three people. Three people. Who are those three people? Well, one, it would be, you know, um, their own villain, you know, like their own uh, new villain that they just created up off the blue. I think that one might hold hold more because I really I don't see who the, who <laughs> who would bring Android 16 back to life. Um, so, uh, you know, their own villain to Dr. Jero if this man somehow has survived I don't know he put his consciousness in another body look that one is my last thought like that one really doesn't make sense if it's <laughs> Dr. Jero and lastly Boma now with Boma I know you're like what Boma what why why would she do this like I'm not saying Boma has turned evil on us all of a sudden no <laughs> but see this okay let me let me tell y'all what I think 
how the story would go you know now this is just my opinion my idea I really doubt that they're gonna go this way cuz um you know the art system they make some great stories like uh, for Guilty Gear and Bla uh, Blaze Blue they, they make some great story modes now sometimes they can get a little confusing but <laughs> they're, they're good story modes now what I, what I was thinking, you know, you know, we all know Goku and Vegeta, they're always going out, you know, training in another place, like whether that be King Kai's planet or with Beerus and Whis. And, you know, maybe Boma's like, well, you know, on Earth, you know, that leaves Earth in danger just in case they get attacked. Yeah, they got Gohan, but I was thinking this could take place, like, maybe after the Goku Black arc, you know, I, this is, I'm just thinking, you know, if y'all have better ideas, y'all can put them in the comment section, but this could take place, like, after the Goku Black arc, now, you know, Bone was like, well, we have Gohan, but he sucks, <laughs> and, you know, at this point, he hasn't started training yet after the, he starts training after the Goku Black arc, so it's like, you know, we have Gohan, and, you know, he sucks, and everybody else is like, kind of, eh, on power level here, so, you know, maybe she's like, you know what, we, I need to build, maybe, uh, another Z fighter. I need to um, create somebody strong. So then she's like, oh, you know what? Let me rebuild Android 16. So then, you know, you know, I, I, I think, and I don't think I'm the only one that thinks this. Obviously, I feel like Boma, at, especially in Super, is way smarter than Dr. Jarrell. I mean, I think that's a given. So it's not crazy to say Boma could recreate Android 16 make him stronger than what he was I'm pretty sure she could even make him like somewhere close to Goku and Vegeta cuz look look guys if you watching super some of these people is questionable how they're even keeping up with them so <laughs> let's not argue that down so she creates Android 16, but you know, Boma's with her fault. So maybe somehow by adding new stuff to him, like it messes up his system, which turns him evil. Something like that. And so, you know, he starts going on a rampage. And let's hypothetically say, now this is where the roster comes in. Because if y'all know, if y'all play uh, fighting games quite often, usually, and I say usually because like maybe like. 80% of the time the characters that are on the roster are gonna be in the story mode now That's strange right cuz you know we like so far we have like cell and Frieza for example on the roster And you're like how are they gonna fit in the story? What if like Android 16 evil Android 16 cuz I think the story mode is supposed to not only revolve around him But like androids in general what if Android 16 just starts creating androids of like different fallen villains that they fight now I know what y'all are thinking too. That kind of sounds familiar, right? Well, that kind of sounds like um, The plan to eradicate the Saiyans, you know, uh, but the only difference with that is I think they were made of they were made of some kind of gas, which is very strange. But <laughs> maybe Android 16 just starts making androids of all their fallen villains. That's as far as I got with my story mode idea. I mean, obviously Android 16 is going to be a threat. I mean, if we're looking at these scans, Vegeta's looking like he's not having a good day. I mean, I was like, wow, Android 16 is putting in work on Vegeta? Like, something's not right. So that's why I'm kind of skeptical. I'm trying to figure out what like where would this be placed and also too i was thinking like um like at first when i heard about the what if story i was thinking okay they're gonna have different what if stories but i don't know i'm thinking this might just be the only story like android 16 this is, is the whole story most i'm i'm wondering like how that's gonna work like is he gonna have like some kind of new form is he gonna like uh upgrade himself like it's just so curious like like that's like the weirdest choice i've ever seen that's like <laughs> it's like if they were like you know what we're gonna open <laughs> We're gonna we're gonna open up Dead Zone. Let's bring Garlic Jr. back. Like, <laughs> I mean, is Garlic Jr. even canon? I don't even think he's canon. Nah, uh, but anyway, you know, that's I'm just saying that's like a weird choice. Like having Android 16 be the center villain. So I mean, it's, we don't have that much info just yet. So I'm I'm gonna be waiting to see. Like maybe they'll have a scan. You know, uh, giving us more info on the story mode. And also, you know, I'm hoping to see a trailer uh, soon. I'm surprised. Like I said earlier, we haven't even gotten a Krillin and Piccolo trailer yet. And that was a long time ago. And now we got all these new characters, the story mode information. Like, a trailer is due, right? <laughs> a trailer is definitely due. So, but that's all I got I want to talk about. 
if y'all have any story mode ideas how y'all think it's gonna go uh how y'all think they could do android 16 for him to work <laughs> uh please leave them down in the comment section below if you like the video like the video uh for more dragon ball fighter for more dra for more dragon ball fighter z video topics discussions all that good stuff make sure i hit that subscribe button below and as always guys it's been your boy x and i'm out deuces